and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you my Bobby Brown must-haves slash beginner set because I've had so many of you guys asking me about it, which products are the best from Bobbi Brown and which to start out with. Bobbi Brown is a high-end makeup brand so it is a bit more expensive than if you just went out and bought L'Oreal or Maybelline. So you have to be a bit more, you know, considerate about what you buy. And since I work at Bobbi Brown, I feel like that I've got a great knowledge about all of the different products and how they work and which works the best for beginners and pros and whatever. So if you're interested in Bobbi Brown products and which I really find the best, keep watching. To start out, I always think that it's important to have a good primer and a good moisturizer. And the great thing about Bobbi Brown is that they have a two-in-one product. In all of the face creams from Bobbi Brown, there is actually a primer in it because of the hyaluronic acid in it. So all of the face creams, they will both hydrate and moisturize, but also prime your face and make sure that the makeup will set much better on the skin and last for much longer. The one that I've picked out is the Vitamin Rich Face Base. The reason why I've chosen this cream instead of all of the other ones is because this one is all free. So almost no matter which skin type you've got, whether you're oily or dry, you can use this one. There's shea butter in it and vitamin C and E, so it's really great for the skin. It's hydrating and moisturizing without being too moisturizing. The next product that I'm going to share with you is probably like the key product from Bobbi Brown, if you ask me. Many would say it's the gel liner, but I definitely say that it's a skin foundation stick. This is the most amazing quick fix foundation in the entire world. You can use it both as a foundation, as a concealer, it can go from a light medium to a full coverage. It doesn't like cake up during the day, it just sets so nicely on the skin. It looks like skin, that's why it's called skin foundation. I absolutely love it and I think it's so easy just to pat onto your skin and then rub it with your fingers or with a brush, you really decide yourself. And it's just such a nice travel size as well because it's got a lid on it and yeah, you can have it with you in your bag if you're out partying and you just want to touch up, whatever. And as I said, because it's got so many different levels of coverage, you can use it as a concealer as well. So to me, if I had to advise you to buy one product from Bobbi Brown, this would probably be it. Before moving on to the eye area, I've got one more product to show you that I think is just a must-have from Bobbi Brown, and it is definitely the bronzing powders. There are so many different shades, but the ones that I really like are either Golden Light or Natural. And I use Golden Light if I want a really nice glow to the skin, like a really nice golden glow. It's great for those of you who are a bit more fair in your skin, like me, I've got really fair pale skin, so if you've got skin like me, this would be really great. It just gives such a nice, healthy glow to the skin, and I just like to use it as a bronzer around my face and also on my neck area, actually, because I just feel like that it bronzes up my skin so nicely without looking orange. And the other one that I want to share with you is actually more of a cooler bronzer, and therefore I like to use it as a contour shade. It is the one called Natural, and as you can see, it's a bit more cool in its undertones, which I really like. I like to use it for contouring, especially right here and also my nose area. I just think it's such a great contour shade. So they are great for different things. This one is great for if you want to bronze up your skin and this one is great if you want to contour, at least when you've got skin like mine. Maybe if you're a bit darker, you can actually use this one as a bronzer as well, but for me, this is like the perfect contour shade. And a little extra pro tip for you guys, you can also use these as eyeshadows because they are really, really pigmented. So if you just want a really nice, kind of like everyday smoky eye, just go in with either the golden light or natural, depends on which kind of tone you want your eyeshadows to be. And then just blend it out with a blending brush and then load some mascara on and you're good to go. Moving on to the eye area, you've heard me talk about this product so, 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 so much here on my channel. You're probably like sick of hearing about it now, but it is the Bobbi Brown Perfectly Defined Longwear Brow Pencil. It is by far one of my favorite brow pencils. This is a bit more thick, so it gives off a lot more product just at once but you can still be very precise with it, depends on which kind of sides you use on it. But I just really like it, it also comes with spoolie in the other end and it's just so great for if you're traveling or whatever or if you just want to do your brows really quickly. And I just think it's so, so, so freaking idiot proof. It is also waterproof, so if it's raining or something like that, you don't have to worry about your brows going like down here. 
So um, this will stay on. And if you want to see this one in full action, I have done a brow routine with this one, which I will leave down below in the description box. The next thing I want to share with you are the Longwear Cream Shadow Sticks. And I like these ones because they are kind of like max paint pots, but they come in sticks instead of like in pots. Which I think is so much easier to work with because you can just glide it on and then just use a brush or your finger to just blend it in and then it's on. You can use it as a primer as I said, but you can also use it as an eyeshadow on its own. And as I said, it's from the long wear line, which means it will last up to 16 hours of wear. This color here is called Vanilla, which is the one that I use today just as an eye base and just as a general just eyelid shade because as you can see it just looks like skin when it gets on but you can also get them with colors in them. The one that is my favorite is the one called Golden Bronze which is such a beautiful bronzy shade. You can get some that are shimmery, you can get some that are matte. This one is shimmery, the other one vanilla is matte. So there's a great variety of either mattes or shimmers and as you can see Golden Bronze is just beautiful and this one on the entire lid that's your smoky eye. So quick, so simple, so easy. Now, if there's one thing that I feel like is underestimated when it comes to Bubble Brown, it's their eyeshadows. They are so freaking good, and I personally especially love the matte shades. I've got two matte shades here that I think are really, really great for starting out with wearing eyeshadows or just wanting to define your crease and your eyes a tiny bit. This one is called Ivory and this one is called Taupe and as I said they're both matte shades but they're great if you want to do a nice everyday eye. The only color that I've used today is this one, Ivory, but you can definitely use this one as well in your crease. These are my favorites actually and I think they're great and I think most skin tones can use these as well. I just think they're great, they're so blendable and they're just very very pigmented as well as you can see. Let's move on to mascara. Recently I have discovered the most amazing mascara in the entire world. And I honestly think it's my favorite of all mascaras that I've ever 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 tried and I'm not even joking you guys. It is hands down amazing. It is the Extreme Party Mascara from Bobbi Brown. It is incredible. And actually, let me just say one thing about the packaging because many people, they're like, why is it so little and so expensive? You don't get what you pay for, blah, 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 blah. Well, it is smaller because there is less space for air in the actual tube. So it's more like concentrated with the product in there. So there's not that much space for air when you open it and close it. So it won't dry out that quickly. And also, mascaras, they are actually meant to be like shifted every three months. So this will last you for three months straight and then you need to use a new mascara in order to be more hygienic and so on. So don't think that you don't get what you pay for, you totally do. The mascara brush is kind of like a standard mascara brush as you can see and I remember when I saw this one I was like well it's not going to be as good as so many other mascaras but damn, look at this. Look at this. The mascara seriously works so, so well. It is very voluminizing, it's very lengthening as well, it's very separating. I just feel like that you get the most perfect lashes with this mascara. And I tried a lot of mascaras. I am a mascara hoarder and I'm always up for trying a new mascara. But this, this is my new love and I love it so much. I would definitely recommend it. Either this one or the Smoky Eye Mascara. Those two are my favorites from Bobbi Brown by far. That was all for the eye area, now let's move on to the lips because I feel like lips are so 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 important and as you know with me, I am in love with Bobbi Brown's lip liners. They are my everything and I seriously, I use them almost every single day and my two favorite shades are right here. This one is called Ballet Pink, it's a very kind of neutral pink, very natural pink, your lips fit better kind of color if you ask me, it is right there. And it's just really beautiful once it gets on the lips. It just glides on very, very smoothly. And I would say if you've got really dry lips or flaky lips, I would advise you to use our lip balm before you use the lip liners. Our lip balm is not that slippery, so it's kind of like a lip primer if you get what I mean. So it will glide on much more like smoothly onto the lips but still give that very intense color. The other shade that I really like is called Pale Mob, and it's just such a gorgeous, deep, cool toned mauvey shade and it is just such a cool shade to wear on your entire lips without anything else and that is kind of like actually one of my go-to lip looks and if you want a bit more of a creamy finish as I've got right now I actually use the Bobbi Brown lip color in the color brownie pink which is a really nice 
browny pink shade and I must say I am very much in love with the lipsticks from Bobbi Brown because they are very hydrating on the lips and they actually last for a really long time as well. This one is the original lip color range but there's also the rich color line which is a bit more rich in the colors and a bit more vibrant. We've also got the sheers and the creamy ones and the creamy matte ones so there's a lip stick finish for everybody I would say and the most important thing for me is that none of them are like drying on the lips so they are very very comfortable to wear and the last kind of like finishing touch to my skin that I really 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 love and can't live without is highlighting my like cheekbones right here and the product that I use is the Bobbi Brown Shimmer Break Compact my favorite color is the one called beige because I feel like that it goes with so many different skin tones whether you're really really pale like me or really dark skinned it doesn't really matter this is going to be so great for everybody and there are five individual shades you can mix and match them however you like you can use them as eyeshadows as well if you want to I just think this is such a great invention and the glitters and the shimmers in it they're just so fine and so beautiful and as you can see it gives such a beautiful finish to the skin. These are kind of like a collector's thing for me. I've done an entire video about all of my shimmer break compacts from Bobbi Brown and I'll also leave it down below in the description box. I just quickly wanted to mention especially the one called beige because it goes with all skin tones and it's just so beautiful. Now for brushes and the full coverage face brush which I think is such a necessity if you want to really buff in and blend in your foundation. It is amazing for that job. If you like to use mineral powders you can use this one as well. It is just great for both liquids, creams, powders, you can use it for everything because it's synthetic brush. The two other brushes that I want to show you are made from goat hair and this one is your sheer powder brush. And the reason why I want to show you this one in particular is because you can use it once again for so many different things. You can use it for blush, to contour, to bronze, to set your under eye area, to use it for powders, you can use it for so many different things and that's why I really like it and it's a bit more tapered at the end so you can be really precise with it but you can also use it on the flat side if you want to pack on a bit more colour, I just really like it. It is an amazing brush and it is by far one of my favourite brushes in my entire brush collection. The last one is the Eye Sweep brush and many people are like what am I going to use that for but I love it because it is so quick and so easy to just brush on your eyeshadows with this one because it's a bit more big as you can see and round as well and I also like it to set my under eye area because I feel like that it covers a lot of like space on my skin but it's not too big either, it's just a really nice middle size. And the very last product that I want to mention really, really quickly is something that is very underrated but so worth it. It is the Bobbi Brown Brush Cleansing Spray. The reason why I really wanted to give a shout out to this product is because it comes in a pump so you don't have to use water or rinse your brushes. You just spray this one straight onto the brush and then swirl your brush around in some kitchen roll or whatever you've got and then once it's clean, it's clean and it's ready to be used once again. It is so quick, simple, easy and it's really great because it's got oils in it so it's very nourishing to your brushes as well and will just make sure that your brushes will stay better for much longer. And that was actually all for my Bobbi Brown Beginners Kit and I really hope that this was helpful for you guys. So many of you guys have been asking me which products I recommend from Bobbi Brown and these are definitely like my core products. I was just about to say core ingredients but core products, okay? So if you want a really nice everyday makeup like I've got on today, these products are amazing. And that's the thing with Bobbi Brown's makeup, it makes you look so perfect in such a natural way and you don't really have to use that much product either so I just love it. I think it makes you look so beautiful and so fresh and awake and nice and yeah. I just really like the philosophy behind Bobbi Brown's makeup. It should look like skin and it should just enhance your natural beauty. So if you found this video helpful in any way at all, please let me know by liking this video. Leave a comment down below as well and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. If you've got any questions about any Bobbi Brown products at all, leave them down below and I'll try to answer as many of them as possible. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so very much and have the most amazing day. Bye!